साइंस न्यूज Ever pondered the origin of the dark dunes on Titan, Saturn's largest moon? These vast enigmatic fields of sand beneath the moon's tangerine skies have long puzzled scientists. But a new hypothesis suggests an intriguing possibility. These dunes may have originated from comets. Planetary scientist William Botkey suggests that over the course of our solar system's history, a significant amount of cometary material may have struck Titan enough to form its extensive dune fields. This theory is supported by computer simulations which propose that these drifts formed from objects hailing from the primordial Kuiper belt, a modern source of comets beyond Neptune's orbit. This scenario could also account for the presence of similar material observed on other celestial bodies. The nature of Titan's sand has been a subject of speculation for a long time. The most popular hypothesis posits that these sands consist of organic particles produced by solar irradiation of the moon's hazy atmosphere. Once these micron-sized particles fall to the surface, they somehow grow into larger sand-sized grains capable of forming dunes. However, the exact process of this growth remains unclear, and laboratory tests suggest that these organic particles may not be resilient enough to withstand the formation of dunes. Botka and his team propose an alternative scenario, one that takes us back to the early history of the solar system, around 4 billion years ago. It was during this period that the giant planets are thought to have migrated, passing through the Kuiper belt and leading to a grand reshuffling. This movement resulted in the bombardment of Titan and other moons by comets, many of which were pulverized into tiny particles upon collision. These particles are surprisingly resilient, able to survive even after passing through our atmosphere. They are dark, and around 200 microns wide, making them the perfect size to build the dark dunes on Titan. Through computer simulations, Botki and his team tracked the evolution of Saturn, Jupiter, and their moons during this chaotic period, estimating the amount of pulverized comet dust and large impactors that fell on Titan and other moons. Their findings suggest that both the dust and the impactors could have delivered more than enough material to form Titan's dunes. The simulations also showed that much of this material struck Jupiter's moons Callisto and Ganymede and Saturn's moon Iapetus, all of which are known to have large patches of dark material. This supports the possibility that Titan's sands could have extraterrestrial origins. However, the fate of this material after reaching Titan's surface remains uncertain. The presence of ice volcanoes on Titan which may be erupting or have erupted in the past adds another layer of complexity to this story. Volcanic eruptions could potentially subsume any falling material, posing a challenge to this hypothesis. To sum up, the dark dunes on Titan, Saturn's largest moon, could potentially have been formed from cometary material that struck Titan billions of years ago. While the exact process remains uncertain, this hypothesis offers a fascinating glimpse into the early history of our solar system and the complex processes that have shaped the worlds within it. Jump.